Turner, six foot, one and a half inches tall, a man with big shoulders. Tonight, he's really got to use them against this stern Polish defence. Vital Loro, man we remember refereeing England against Romania in Guadalajara, Mexico World Cup game, and he let an awful lot of empty tackles get away that afternoon. You remember Mokanu, the Romanian fullback, dished out a fair bit of punishment. This will not be a game tonight that uh, a weak referee should be in charge of. Not to say Vital Loro weak. A good referee, known in his own country as the actor because he's so demonstrative. The Polish team, a lot of strange-looking names there, which I'm sure are going to give me some problems from time to time, but at least Lato is an easy name to say, an easy player to watch, number seven. He with number 11, Godoka, the two front runners, the men that our panel have already predicted could give this England side some trouble. Dania, of course, the captain, number nine, a tremendously skillful player. Tomaszewski, the goalkeeper, they say is six foot four inches tall. He's going to be caught with the aerial battle tonight. Their pressure is going to come on him. And Jersey Gorgon, the big number three. This man who is something of a walking telegraph pole, six foot two and a half inches tall. He He's the strong man in the middle, in the heart of this Polish defence. Poland playing all in red tonight. And England in their traditional colours, the white jerseys, the dark blue shorts. The preliminaries are over. Now the crowd rises. And this tremendously important game is underway. Poland kicking off. Pre-match tactics have been said to be that Poland will hope to suck England forward and strike quickly against them. But here's an England strike and Clark getting in trouble. First foul of the game. Szymanowski. Szymanowski bringing down Clark, the first free kick of the game, and we're in the first minute of the game. Now a situation for England to exploit. Peters over the ball. Curry just behind him, Peters takes it, Chivers goes in. A little bit too long for him. And Tomaszewski immediately in trouble, rolling the ball to Clark's feet. Referee Laroe says there was no foul. The goalkeeper is still down on the ground. As Muschau for Poland knocks it on for Godaka. Good saving tackle then by Hughes. And this ball goes out. Referee Laroe signals to the bench. Tomaszewski wants some treatment. His hand is injured. And no. Referee says play on. Bell knocks it out, and again, Tomaszewski is signalling to the referee that his hand is hurt. And finally, referee Loro points to the goal area. So there, right in the first opening minutes of the game, Tomaszewski, the number one goalkeeper, gets himself a hand injury, a situation that he made for himself. And there's agony on his face, looking as though he may very well have dislocated a finger at the least. Tenseness now in the faces of all these Polish players. Well, if it was dislocated, the quick, rough treatment of giving it a swift grab has put it back in place, but now we wonder how much Extra pressure that is put on goalkeeper Tomaszewski. Musha getting himself in a lot of trouble down there. A hard player, but not the most skillful of defenders, Musha. Shivers is going to test him with a long throw. Peters up. It's Dania who knocked it out. 
tackle then after the ball had gone. Another free kick to England. And referee Loro certainly exerting his influence on this game immediately. Bell quickly then for Madeley. A lot of problems in there. Just hoisted away by Shimacic. And Tomaszewski under pressure again. Musha. Good long ball out, well read by Madeley. Colin Bell through for Chivers. Peters on again for Bell. And he's still got it. Emlyn Hughes. Support from Hunter. Good ball, Bell. Peters. Clark. Cut and back for Curry to hit. Well, this is the sort of start England wanted. The shot not on target, but immediately signs of panic in the Polish defence as Tony Curry knocked that ball over the bar. Four minutes gone. Good knock on by Damaski. And Shilton touches the ball for the first time in the game. Evelyn Hughes. Clark. A little bit too far back. Curry well positioned. Clark takes it on. Madeley is coming on the outside, but not quite long enough for him. Curry looking back for McFarland. All the action in the Polish half of the field. Alan Clark. Peters Clark too long for him. Dania. A clump coming down as Evelyn Hughes went steaming in. Goal kick. Goal kick. The ball well spotted by referee Loro was knocked onto Evelyn Hughes leg. Tomaszewski got his first game for Poland against West Germany two years ago didn't have a very good game then he was knocked out of the side but he's been in regularly recently capped ten times for his country Colin Bell down Kasper Jack losing out Buljaki and here's Dania long for Damaski First signs then of a Polish strike and they came out fast. Dania, the man who prompted it. Kasper Jack with this throw in. Damaski turning. Watch Leto. Leto hanging about, hoping that Shilton wouldn't handle the ball firmly. Leto getting a lecture from the referee for preventing Shilton releasing the ball quickly. So a free kick to England, way back in their own goal mouth. Madeley starting, England going again. Shannon back, Peters Shannon. He's got the shot on now. Was that a corner? No goal kick. Shannon broke well in. For a moment I thought he might have had a shot on just outside the box. But he went on going. But this is great stuff for England. At least they're shooting on sight as soon as they get on the target area. Madeley forward. Gadocker. He's in trouble there, losing it to Bell. Clark. The return ball for Bell. Pressure on Gorgon. And he stretched Gorgon. Gadocker. Looked like handball by Norman Hunter. Mandena. For the Gudaka. She makes it. 
Dania getting tackled in possession and the break on for England again. Shannon going against Bulzatsky. And he got himself a corner out of it. First corner of the game. Tony Curry will come across to take it. Now let's see what Tomaszewski does. Ball doesn't reach him. Ball maybe looking for Tony Curry again. Curry for Shannon. Did that beautifully against Mushai. Good cross for post. Peters. Martin Peters looking down as though he was steering it back across the face of the goals and looking for shivers, but in fact, I thought he had a shot on. Have a look again then as Curry knocks this long across the box. Peters looked as though he had the shot on, but he was aiming for Chivers and didn't pick him up. Back in the game again, live. Emlyn Hughes down. Martin Peters. Clark's going fast down the left side. Simonovsky's chasing him. Simonovsky got out of trouble well. Gorgon. Simonovsky doesn't want it there. Just had to hit it hurriedly out. Dana for Gorgon. Gorgon constantly playing deep behind everybody else in defence. Madeley down. Curry. Casper Jack lost it to Curry. Casper Jack back for Musha. Casper Jack. Oh, and. Superb interception by McFarlane. Just didn't allow Damaski to dwell on that ball at all. Dana. Gorgon. Yadoka playing more in midfield in this game than one has got used to seeing him play. It's just Lato and Damaski up the front. Bulzatsky. Good encouragement for England now from the crowd. McFarlane. Emlyn Hughes. It's Latter with him. Hunter for Bell. Clark. McFarlane. Marlon running with the ball, wants somebody running off it for him. Brings Hughes into the game. Colin Bell. Shannon. Oh, it wasn't so far away from being a good cross ball. Tomaszewski didn't know a very great deal about it. See, as this break comes, Bell sets it up with that neat ball for Shannon. He runs Shimanovsky, and that cross ball just behind. Shimanovsky not caught in possession. Gorgon looking here for Godoka. Godoka. Covering. Domaski was hopeful of sending uh, Kasper Jack away. Curry for me. Peters knocking it down. Shivers the challenge. Little Kadoka got there first. Not much on for him. There really wasn't very much on for him. Shannon. 
well on. Did it early aiming for Peters. Dana not going right. Things not going right for Dana tonight. Shannon. Now Dana a chance to set Poland going. And watch Lato now. He's got the speed. That was a handoff by McFarland. McFarland worried immediately then by the first glimpse of Lato's speed. A lad who can do the 100 metres in 10 8 seconds. He really can tank along. Poland, pretty useful in free kick situations. One wonders now what Dana, the skipper, his very thoughtful captain, has worked out. Gorgon. Miskip, a terrible miskip. Alan Clark. England had come back squaring up to the free kick, but now they're moving forward again. Clark down the line for Tony Curry, a little too long for him. Gorgon timing his reliefs from the uh, sweeper position to stop that move. Norman Hunter. Clark. Shivers. Clark again. Poles pretty heavily gathered there. Now it's Godoka. Casper Jack. Uh, well, so Jack wasn't all right there, and he just didn't look to his left to find out what was going on. Tony Curry. The lights of Wembley shining down on Curry. <laughs> well, I can't think that uh, really Poland are starting to waste time already by kicking the ball out of play like that. There's an hour and a quarter of the game left. Colin Bell, Chivers, Curry, far post ball is Shannon, and Szymanowski got it away, corner ball, left side, second corner of the game, Colin Bell trots out to take it, Clark's in the box, 10, and the pressure to come now on Tomaszewski. Bell's corner. Oh, and what a bad one. What a really very bad one. Curry. Peters. It's Godoka facing up to him. Now Domaski. Domaski robs him and letters away. It's a handball by Maitley. And again, the involuntary professional foul by an England player for the second time as... Lato was the, the danger man on for Poland. Well, there's a scoreline that uh, Poland are well satisfied with. Remember, they want a draw here tonight. After 15 minutes, it's naught naught. Dana. Szymanowski. Dana. Hughes, a good interception. Hunter, Maidley, shows the knock on, and Mushar was there to uh, do the interception. Jack, but Peters gets it back for Maidley. Bell. Shannon. Hughes has run wide on the left side. Fine ball for him. Lato came back. Hughes, Shannon. Now Curry. Casper Jack away. Not far enough. Dana takes over. Dana moving smoothly, Domaski going down the right side, it's a bit too long for him. Domaski, the number 10. Norman Hunter, calling people back towards him. Shannon, neat ball down for Chivers. 
Sheffield is going, wants somebody wide on the left. There isn't anybody here. Morgan gets it away. Dana. Shimekovic. Domaski on for Lato. And that wasn't a, a difficult ball to control, but he made hard work of it. So now, a free kick, and one wonders whether England can punish Poland for that wild tackle. Peters over the ball. Chip forward on the far post is McFarland! Well, how did that one not go in? Domaski is deep for Poland. Simacic and McFarland intercepts. McFarland, who came so close then to getting the all-important goal. The crowd still buzzing with the excitement of that moment. Szymanowski. Domaski on. Lato now for Dania. Mouchal's offering him a pass on the left. Dana getting a second chance. Shimekiewicz. McFarlane can't afford to make a mistake here. The Poles building good pressure in this situation. Dana neatly done. Hunter. Fine ball for Curry. Poles absolutely racing back. Bell's gone offside, so he can't play it forward. Clark now. Shannon against Musha. And a corner given. Musha looked as though he uh, gave a sort of ice hockey body check to knock Shannon away at that moment. Yet another corner. Third corner for England. Gorgon, the big blonde boy on the far post. Taking a look at Clark. Curry's corner. Peters. Bell way back for Emlyn Hughes. Madeley. Shannon up, not high enough. Bujaki was there. Bell forward. Bujaki again. Shannon. Chivers. Oh, Jackie really hacked that one away. Bulzatsky. That's a foul. Indirect free kick. Edmund Hughes to take it. And again, the pressure on Tomaszewski, the goalkeeper, and those red-shirted Polish defenders. Edmund Hughes kick. Curry. Bell, Gorg in the corner. Well, the tempers, the cool of this Polish defence now being put to a very severe examination by the England side. Gorgon keeping his eye on Clark again. It's out for McFarlane. Knocked away that time by Szymanowski for another corner. And the exciting sound of a Wembley crowd rising to encourage England at the moment. Bell. Tomaszewski lost it. Madeley knocks it in again. 
A lot of bodies in the box. Clark is up. Heads it on. Farmacheski hangs on. And Poland hang on. Latter, the only front runner for Poland at that moment. Taken up by Hunter. Madeley knocks it on again. Buljakci. Domaski. Dana. Bulzatsky. Rogan on. Szymanowski. Szymanowski, a little space to advance. Gadoka. Szymakowicz. Gadoka. Gadoka dragging the England defence across. Shivers has come a long way back. Bouchard stops him. The knock-on is on for Lato. Damask is in the box. Too long for him. Evelyn Hughes. Peters, the free man. It's on again for Madeley. Shivers. Robbed by uh, Bulzatsky. Now Shannon. Shannon taking on Shimanovsky. Good cross across the face of the goals, but too long for everybody. And Mushal, this strongly built fullback, gets it out for Godoka. Mushal again. Dania. Shimikovic. Shimanovsky. Shimikovic. Domaski. Hunter got in hard. Oh, a giftable pass to Dana. That was a bad one. Kasper Jack. Lato knocking it on. Domaski going for the penalty. It never was there. Evelyn Hughes has control of the situation. Tony Curry. Martin Chivers losing to Gordon. Godoka. Casper Jack, Dania. Godoka, well read by Madeley, covered back quickly. Curry for Clark. Peters. Gorgon doing an awful lot of good work in there. Well read by Bell. Bouchard looking for his goalkeeper. Kasper Jack then for Poland. Dana. Lato's offering him a pass down the middle. Now he's going for the right side. Taking Hunter with him, and this fellow really can move. Ball over, goal kick. There haven't really been too many goal kicks for England in the game yet. 25 minutes gone, though, and still no score here in a very tense atmosphere at Wembley Stadium. England, who really wanted the Encouragement and inspiration of an early goal, but not been able to get it. Szymanowski for Poland. Pressure on England now as Madeley comes away. Neatly out for Curry. Nobody down this right side. Now Clark comes. Dana. Szymanowski. Poland putting more men forward now. They've taken some encouragement from the fact that they've held England scorers. And the break on for England as Chivers comes away. Godoka got a bite at him. Godoka getting through a tremendous amount of hard work. Szymanowski. Kasperjev. Lato. 
Shimakovic. Kasper Jack with a shot. First shot of the game from Poland. The very first one of the game from Kasper Jack. given to Poland. Big lad, Jersey Gorman. Another big man, six foot one inches. Ruzatsky. Adventurously moving forward in for Lata. McFarlane covered that time. Lato are certainly providing a few interesting problems for the England defence to solve. up the red shirt to Poland and we wind up with a foul throw anyway Emlyn Hughes to show him how it should be done Hunter Shannon Hughes Curry Madeley is starting to run on the right Harlan supporting from the behind. Bill on again quickly, knowing that Hughes was there. But Damaski was there too. Kasper Jack. Shimanowski. Gorgon. Oh, and he's lost it. He got in pretty darn solidly, though. Really did. Referee Laro decides that it's about time he had a word with Gorgon. Tony Curry is still down injured. Harold Shepherdson's on the touchline. And now he gets called over. So Harold Shepherdson to have a look at uh, Curry's left ankle. The tackle coming after Gorgon had lost the ball and very wildly knowing that he's in trouble goes diving in there showing all six studs and Curry goes down Tony Curry limping back into the game and Hunter takes the free kick Shivers challenging Shivers again He's right now for Peters hit Zatsky Shivers, I think, on that occasion, trying to make too sure, it seemed to me, anyway, an opportunity to just whack a boot at the ball and hope that it flies into the net. Yet another corner, Tony Curry. McFarlane, and now Peters. Well, that was high, wide, and really not very handsome from Martin Peters. Although I was inviting England to take a, a whack at a ball a moment earlier. A little desperation, I think, about that particular effort. Not quite sure whether he intended the shot or whether he was hopeful of setting something up on the far post. Half an hour gone and no score at Wembley. Colin Bell on for Curry. Ball that had got him into trouble, actually. Shemikovic for Gordon. Shemikovic. That's Hunter. Clark. Too many people there. Evelyn Hughes, the shot's on. And he whacked it well. Lato out for Poland. Being chased. My bell and Lato lost him. Domarski. Mushal for Godoka. Now it's got to start from midfield again. Godoka. 
on, so the quick break has uh, now evaporated. So eager to keep the game flowing. Clark. Peters. Maidley. Not quite long enough. Zemikiewicz. Lato. In his more usual place out on the right side. Domaski. Zemikiewicz. Hunter reading it well. But losing. And helped out by Colin Burr. Szymanowski prepared to take the throw in. Dania. Dania, this talented player, the scorer of two goals in the final against Hungary when Poland won the Olympic trophy. Dania. Michal on. Kasper Jack on for Mushal again. A little bit too long for Lato. Noticeably, Hunter was there to do the tidying up again. Emin Hughes. Oh, a lucky one. Bell gets it for Peters. Faced by Gorgon. Far post, Clark under it. Took the chance away from Shannon. Although I imagine Clark had no way of knowing that Shannon was right behind him at that moment. There are occasions when England seem to be putting two players at the same ball. Peters now looking at the far post with that cross ball. As we see it again in slow motion. Clark unknowingly taking the chance away from Shannon. So we're back in the game again live. Still no score at Wembley. The longer it goes that way, the more Poland will be satisfied and the more anxious England will be. Here's Peters. And Gorgon was the man who got in the way. Foul call against McFarlane, stopping the number 10, Domarski. Jan Domarski, one of the uh, Stal Milczek players in the side. Three of them in the side, Lato, Kasperjak and Domarski. They won the Polish Championship for the first time this last season. Harlan Hughes. Again, the encouraging roars of the Wembley crowd coming up. And a few hunting horns echoing for Poland. Shannon, Chivers. Bulzatsky with Chivers. Way back for Hunter. McFarlane. Madeley, and it's too far behind him, so the whole attack breaks down. Poland practically everybody goal side of the ball now. Chivers! Down! Clark! Well, that was a chance. A fractional chance. This long ball, Chivers fighting for it on the far post, knocks it down, and Gorgon it was, holding off Clark, did just enough, and in fact looked very much as though he tripped him after the ball had gone. McFallon, and again McFallon, and Curry, and oh! Gorgon and Mujal in an argument with referee Lato, and he's reaching into his pocket, but he's given a free kick. Here's the incident again. Curry whacking it hard, bodies all over the place. And an offside flag, in fact, had caught Clark off. So, still no score. But one wonders how long this Polish defence can hold out. Maidley. Way back for Hunter. Shivers down. Neatly for Peters and good covering by Kasper Jack. 
Hughes. Hughes making an angle, and Bell with a shot. Colin Bell. Getting on the end of that fast-moving England build-up then. Hughes the man, as we see it again, building it up. The Poles, there's a whole flock of them in the box, and Bell's got to hit it hard. Hughes forward for Clark. And again, the red shirts converge on that situation. Poland with the chance of qualifying for the first time since 1938 for a World Cup final session. Really are defending tremendously well as Clark builds this attack up. And Gorgon knocks it out again. The whole Polish side, bar Domaski in their own half. Against Buzatsky now. Gorgon the man again. Maidley beautifully done. McFarland. Bell. He's in trouble there. McFarland done. Latto on the break. Stopped by Hunter. The crowd rise to Norman. Off plate Curry cut that in well. Good ball on for Shannon. Post is Peters and now Chivers and again Morgan got in the way of it and the chance on the bell that is just about the most exciting goal activity I've seen in a long time another corner but look what was happening in there the shot on the end from Bell and that wonderful save from Chomachevsky this is the seventh corner for England. Curry. And now the eighth corner for England. Off Gadaka that time. And now Poland have their entire side. The whole team is in their own penalty area. All 11 of them. Five England men in there as well. Curry with the corner. Hughes. Curry, if he can get there. And another corner. Well, this is unrelenting pressure now from England. And still they can't pierce that brave red wall of Polish defenders. Curry then with a the corner. Flies away for Peters. Emlyn Hughes wants it. That's Bell. Tomaszewski's come, and he held it well. And a little breathing space for these Poles who have been put really on the rack. Godoka. Poland desperately trying to slow the game down to get themselves with a breathing space. Gorgon, who has played a tremendous part in defence, getting it out. Dana. Chemikiewicz. Five minutes to go to half time. As Clark breaks. Evelyn Hughes. Hunter. Constant white wave of England shirts breaking against the Polish defence. Dana. Jemikiewicz. Oh, that's a bad ball. Maidley won it well. Shivers with support. Bell. England getting so much of the ball, in fact, that they're getting in each other's way at times. Evelyn Hughes. Not getting so much of the ball, winning so much of the ball. Curry. 
and the ball for Hunter. Yet another corner. Well, that's the tenth corner for England in this first half, which has now got about four minutes to go, and Poland haven't had one yet, but it's goals that matter. Jemikiewicz knocks it out. Shannon wants the throw in taken quickly. Oh, he did that neatly. The pressure still on, shivers across. And look at him. Referee won't have it. Curry. Gives the free kick on this occasion against Shemikiewicz. Shot on for Emily Hughes. Not now. McFarlane. Clark's all right. Nearly squeeze one in as the Poles were looking for the offside decision, which wasn't there. Here it is again, Clark and Tomaszewski makes the save as now we're back live with the corner. Shot on, McCurry. Tomaszewski's still a mile up his line. This is the most incredible first half of football that I've seen for a very, very long time. Shivers the long throw. Tomaszewski must be wearing all kinds of lucky charms under that yellow jersey. Oh, a beautiful run by Klein Bell off Dania. Tomaszewski punching. He's at panic stations. Madeley. And a hit for a corner. Solid, unrelenting pressure from England, and still they can't get that goal. Over eagerness, over eagerness a lot of the time. Komachevsky's come. Got a half a hand to it. And a goal kick at last as Poland say a little prayer and say thank you very much. Tomaszewski really looking as though he needs a rest. There is a puffed young man. 25 years old, and he'll remember this, I think he's 11th international for many years to do. Casper Jack running into Clark. Gorgon, an easy ball back. Kibitjevic. Evelyn Hughes winning it powerfully and well. Chivers losing out to Kasper Jack. Now Gadoka for Poland. Giving Maitley a run. Looking for support. Picks up Simikiewicz in midfield. Kasper Jack looking wide to the right side for Szymanowski. Dania is in trouble. Good offer. Can hit him from there. Lato. Very nearly got in. Bell down the line for Shannon. Bell again. Shannon. Ran into trouble then. Bell neatly for McFarlane. Shivers down for Shannon and loses it. Ball cannons away for Peters. On for Clark. Looking for Shannon. And a ball is outside from Tomaszewski. Wasn't much wrong with that piece of goalkeeping. As we can see again, that fine cross ball from Clark. And watch the way Tomaszewski gets off the ground. He really had to climb for that one. Corner kick, and another corner off Gorgon. The corner score really piling up, as it looks to me as though we've gone into added time for stoppages. 14 corners. 
Bill Horwood. When Mushal getting one in the face as uh, Chiba's boot went a little bit high. It was more the bravery of the player that got himself hurt then. And we shall not have time to uh, restart. We've got a uh, half-time situation then, a tremendous first half of football, I'm sure you'll agree. We're going to take the break. We'll find out now as England prepare to kick off with just 45 minutes left to break the deadlock. They have got to score a goal and we're away in the second round. And again, this fine crowd at Wembley picks it up for the England side. Certainly the response from the crowd has been all that England could have wanted. Here's Hunter pushing England forward again. Shannon. Szymanowski robbed him. Good tackle by Hunter, he just won't let him play. Szymanowski looking down the line. Push by McFarland, or rather a push on McFarland by Domaski with the ball in a different place at part of the field. Hunter's free kick. Bouchard whacks it away. Games between these two sides in the past have produced a lot of goals. It was 1-1, you remember, at Goodison. Bobby Moore got an equaliser back in January 66. Corner ball. It was 1-0 in Katowice in July 66 when Roger Hunt scored the goal. Poland with those two dramatic goals in Katowice last June. They're the side that have put the pressure on England. Latto just scraping it away with the top of his head. Domaski, the only front runner at the moment. Dana knocking it out as Latto has now gone forward. Hunter has him positioned well. Colin Bell. Wide, wide on the far side and over his head the ball goes. Tony Curry. Gadoka. Chimavitz. Lato giving it a chase and Hunter again. Godoka. Godoka showing the way he's played throughout the whole of the 45 minutes. What Poland came here for. A draw will do them. And they've been playing for it. Godoka, good ball. Mushal. Now Poland are beginning to put a few bodies forward. Bulzatsky. Evelyn Hughes winning it, losing it, Shivers takes it. Hughes again. Hughes again. Peters the ball outside. Searching for Clark. There's an offside flag against Clark anyway. Alan Clark pushing forward into the box. A rapacious young man when it comes to looking for and taking goal chances. Szymanowski. Szymatik. Szymakowicz. Support from Domaski. Szymanowski. Szymakowicz. Szymanowski. Just the wrong side, so Hunter comes away for England. We're looking for Channon here. Hunter. Little ball on for Peters. Now there's a break building with Curry going down the right side. Stretched wide and Mushal comes charging in. Bangs the ball against Curry and it's a goal kick. Jersey Gorgon, 
who hasn't done much wrong in Poland's defence tonight. Daniel whacking it forward, Lato again eagerly looking for it, the pressure on Hunter and he stuck it well, Domaski tries one! An enterprising shot then from Domaski, Jan Domaski. Played against uh, England and Wales in the two games in Poland. sentiments I'm sure are echoed by Sir Alf Ramsey at this moment a plaintive give us a goal Mushal deliberately handling the ball the free kick now for Maidley Dania headed it up Domaski trying to shield the ball Ooh, and Kasper Jack lost his legs to Norman Hunter And Brian Clough has christened Norm Beutcher leg Hunter. And the big fella, Gorgon. Bell for Tony Curry. Good ball, switching the point of attack way across this side of the field to Hughes. Hunter supporting inside. Chance to run as Poland funnel back again. What a fine ball, a little too long for Peters, but what imagination. Maidley, a very powerful header forward, Chivers, Shannon. Szymanowski gets rid of Shannon's threat. Referee Laura. Laura now deciding that he's going to make sure that the wall is the proper distance back, and it's got a long way to go. A long, long way. So we've got Peters over the ball. Curry is with him and Hunter's going to try the shot and the corner to England Norman Hunter then the man who saved England's faces here against Wales when he hit a spectacular equaliser that allows this game in fact to take place today because if England had lost that one this match wouldn't have mattered at all Tomaszewski fortunate to get that with the challenge coming from Shannon then Godoka and Maidley comes to it. Godoka again. Way back. Uzatsky a bit dangerous to knock it back now for Gorgon. Well off by Clark. Jimmers and the shot on the Curry. Tony Curry, the chance of a lifetime then to have broken this deadlock. Look at the way Gorgon was robbed by Clark magnificently Chivers the ball rolled into Curry's path Tomaszewski a mile off his line to narrow the angle but he really ought not to have been given any chance back in the game live as Gorgon takes the goal kick well the break's still not coming England's way Clark for Shannon oh that's not a good return ball Kamitkiewicz for Dana. Szymanowski is out to his right. Szymanowski now. Gadoka. Kamitkiewicz. Bell for Clark. Chibber is tanking down this left side. Szymanowski comes to him. Well taken. Well taken, Tomaszewski. Clark went into him. The goalkeeper again in trouble. 
Buzatsky complaining that the challenge on the goalkeeper was unfair. Well, we can see it again and just see, in fact, whether this was fair or not. Chivers knocks the ball across the goals. The goalkeeper takes it well. I don't think Clark could have saved himself, and he tried to jump over the player. Quite clearly, then, he did not play the player. He jumped over him. The crowd reckon that... Uh, Tomaszewski is milking this, so does the referee. He won't have any more of this. But he has, in fact, given the free kick. Hughes punching it forward. Alan Clark for Bell. For the referee who uh, decided he didn't want to play. Domaski, there goes Godoka. Hunter, the challenge coming from Domaski. Paul Mabley, his Leeds United colleague, starting something going the far side. Colin Bell. For Adlin Hughes, what a beautiful ball. First timer. Hughes for Curry to try one. That one's on target. And now Shannon. Wow! Well, he hit that one into the side netting. The crowd almost standing to give the, an ovation to that spectacular bit of football. You can look at that shot of Tony Curry's again. Tomaszewski not daring to try and catch it. And Shannon the volley doing just what we were hoping they would do, whack it quickly. And again, the roars of the Wembley crowd come up and then die as the foul is given against Emlyn Hughes for bundling into Domaski. Ten minutes gone, 35 minutes to go. Still no goals. The game England have got to win to go to Germany in the World Cup Finals. Fiamikiewicz for Godoka. Well read and well won by McFarland. Now McFarland breaking up. Alan Clark, knowing that he was going to get tackled from behind, still stuck in there. Clark for Bell. Clark. Wide for Maidley. Made it his ball against the challenge of Casper Jack. Now Hunter. Tony Curry and Musal gets a piece of it. And a very solid piece too. Colin Bell. Maidley. Curry. Faced by Casper Jack. Casper Jack got enough. Lato screaming down the right side. Let Left side rather. Now it's Lato against McFarlane and Gadok. Gadok is over there. The shot is on for Damaski. Oh, and he scored! Damaski's got a goal! one nothing Poland. A tragedy that England might have expected. The Poles going mad around the score of Damaski. Here it is again. Lato doing the breakout as they caught England all the way forward. And Domaski coming in now. The challenge of Hughes, not quite enough. And it's in the back of the net. 12 minutes gone. Jan Domaski, the hero of Poland at this moment. The man who came on for the Polish hero, Lewanski, against England in Katowice. Now England have got it to do. Now England have got it to do. They've got at least two goals to score. One goal is no good to them now. Shivers. Peters up. The flick on for Clark. He knocks it back. And there's the equaliser. No. It's been knocked off. Shannon knocked it in. Referee Laurent knocks it off. The crowd stunned. When we look at it again, we may see exactly why. Shivers, the long throw. 
The flick back. Clark. Well, there didn't seem to be anything wrong with that at all. Nothing at all. But it doesn't count. Peters. Evelyn Hughes. Peters now. There goes Shannon. Good cross ball. Didn't come down for Shivers. Gadoka. Not wanting to play. Well, who would have believed that Poland could have soaked up so much punishment for so long and find themselves in front? Almost a plaintive cry of, come on, England, now. Paul Madeley. Back for Peters. And the Poles get way beat in their box. Bell down to Hughes. Bell again. Surely too many bodies there. Peters, good ball on for Curry. Bouchard gives the corner away, but Poland won't mind that. Curry's corner. Hunter. Boot of Bouchard just clears the danger. Curry now. Corner ball given, although from this angle looks as though it was over beforehand, but a corner is given. 18 corners to England. None to Poland, but Poland have got one goal and England haven't any. Foul and cross. Shannon up. Bouchard gets it away. Well, if Poland came here for a draw, they're at least 100% improved on their target. Casper uh, Jack seemed to go high with his boot over the ball then. Curry with the long throw. Dania knocks it out. Pressure is now on England more than, than it's ever been, I suppose, in this Wembley ground. Even more at stake here than in that game against West Germany in the Nations Cup tie. Bouchard out for Godoka. Bouchard. Showing surprising skills in that situation for a man who supposedly not, not too hot on the ground. Has he overdone it? No, he hasn't. Mainly gets it. Clark. Bell. Clark again. And away for a corner. Of Bulzatsky. A little less than half an hour of the game left. England, everything to do now. one nothing down at home. His corner, Paul Madeley. Tremendously quick challenge then from Shimakiewicz. Now Hunter, Madeley. He's under pressure from Gomaski. Latter the challenge on Hughes. McFarland. Bouchard away. England had six men forward then. Gadoka. The Dock are still going with it. Now Hunter comes to bite again. Shemikfimitz. Domaski way back for Musha. Domaski. That's a loose one. Shannon is out. And it's Gorga. Peters quickly in against Musha. It's a penalty. 
Referee Laurel deliberated as Mushal committed the offence. Now the pressure's on Alan Clark. In nine goals for England, he scored three penalties. This, one of the most vital ones of his career. Alan Clark. The eyes of over 100,000 people here at Wembley. On him and the goalkeeper he hopes to beat, Tomaszewski. Shilton can't even look at all, though. Clark, he's got it! 1-1. And England are back in the game. Sending Tomaszewski the wrong way with a swear of hips. So this brave goalkeeper, Tomaszewski, who has saved the side so often tonight. Beaten at last, but it took a penalty to do it. But it's enough for England, they're back in the game, level now. A fraction over 25 minutes of this pulsating game left. Shannon, wide for Curry, and England are pouring forward. Maidley joins in the attack. Godoka. Godoka and moment of peril for England as Poland capitalised on the break and Godoka's in behind them. Lato's in the box. The ball is away. The linesman says it went out of play. This is the peril. This is the torment now for a side. Throwing men forward desperately to get a winning goal. They stand the chance of getting caught when stretched to the limit. Zemikiewicz getting lost on that one. Ruzaki down. Peters. Now Tony Curry. Curry against Kasperjan. Done him once. Not a bad cross ball. Tomaszewski lost that one completely, he was certain it was going behind. He was absolutely certain that this shot now from Curry was going behind. Was completely wrong position for it. We're back with the corner live. But we got an offside flag which stops the action. Damaski has gone down as though polaxed. The referee really just turned his back on it. Damaski, the scorer of the Polish goal. Godoka. Damaski is on this touchline. Poles trying to keep possession. Dana, I haven't seen a great deal of Dana in the second half. Domaski, now it's Dana. Lato is in. Chance on for Kasper Jack to hit it. Kasper Jack. Henry Kasper Jack, again another of these Stalmilec players, the league champions of Poland. Can the nerves, both of the spectators and the players, last out for this remaining portion of the game? Dania Lato. Hunter is the man shadowing him. He's in behind him, but he gets the bite in just the same. Hunter looking a little fraction tired as he made that challenge then. And limping a little. Hunter, who's got through a gallon of work, First corner of the game for Poland.
Godoka, the number 11, to take the corner. And the Poles throw a lot of men forward into the England box. Bending it well. Shilton in no trouble, though. Shannon. Curry. Ball on for Peters again. Now Bell. Gorgon gets the boot in. Knocks it away. Hughes for Maidley. Peters lurking out on that right touchline. Mouchard came to him hard. Mouchard, who has... Mouchard, who has blossomed quite considerably in this uh, second half. Not rated to be a, an elegant fullback. But he certainly got through some useful stuff. That's a uh, foul throw. Curry for Shannon. Didn't get the return ball in. Shannon wins it back. Goal kick. Shannon. Pushing the uh, poles backwards again. Tomaszewski. Getting through some limbering up exercises. As England prepare to send the ball in his direction again. Here's Tony Curry. Clark, good knock on. Gorgon, the man there to get it away. Hunter down. Referee getting in the way, didn't read the situation. Evan Hughes. It's an awkward ball, and Tomaszewski made it his. This man having himself a really fine time, this Polish goalkeeper. Tomaszewski now to chase against Hunter. Maidley for Colin Bell. Evelyn Hughes. Shannon. Foul given against Shannon for charging Szymanowski in the back. Poles who have really been getting a lot of work in. Preparing for this match. Since they played England, they've played a total of uh, nine games. Letting, this was their big moment here at Wembley. Dana. No trouble to play it out. For Poland, their first taste of the uh, sizzling soccer scene here in the Wembley Stadium. And a previous visit to England. They played at Goodison Park up in Liverpool. And the Poles under pressure constantly through this game. It's Edwin Hughes trying to get in against Szymanowski. Jemikiewicz. Well, that's about 18, 19 minutes left. 19 minutes left to decide who goes as the winners of Group 5 to the World Cup Finals. If the score doesn't change, it'll be Poland. Peters. Shannon. Peters, far post, gets it away, Tomaszewski, just the tiniest ends of his fingertips then. Maidley. Colin Bell. Shannon. Shivers. Hooked by Szymanowski, Tomaszewski's not there. Tomaszewski an incredible save, kicked it away from Clark. Now Hughes. 
overrun it. He's overrun it. Now you've got to watch Poland as they break out again. Domaski. Four men screaming forward. Lato is one of them. Gets a chance then as Paul Madeley slipped. Far post ball aimed for Domaski. Tony Curry coming out for England. Clark for McFarlane. And again, there's dogged. Non-stop England side moves forward again. Norman Hunter. Good ball. Peters. Hunter. Right foot. Lomarski back for Godoka. And Curry challenges back, giving the Poles no respite at all. Hughes. Still going. Robbed by Dana. Now Poland. Strike with Dana, and Lato is out to his right. Chemikiewicz. McFarlane knocks it out of play. Well, the... The throw-in, then, for Dana. Semikiewicz. Hunter. Curry. Oh, and Mushal, rugby tackle, referee. Magnificent decision. Plays advantage. And it's getting wild out there now. Shannon across, Clarky! Alan Clark getting on the end of it, but couldn't get it in the net. The anguish in Alan Clark's face then. The chance was there. The goal wasn't. Curry forward. Shivers. Shannon now. Time a few more seconds when it off the uh, off the clock. Referee Loro has made his back to me, but he's pointing to his watch. Shivers the long throw. Curry. Chance on for Colin Bell. Colin Bell has an awful lot of tired legs out on this Wembley turf at the moment. A turf that's been soaked by uh, rain earlier in the week. And that clock up there, less than 15 minutes to go. A worrying sight as Alf Ramsey looks down at his own watch to confirm the situation. 1 1 the score. Line. Hunter winning it as he has done so positively so often this evening. Hughes. Shannon wanting to turn. Against Shimonetsky. Now Peters. Gorgon made it his. Shimonetsky. For Lato. Dana. Good ball. Cheeky one for Kasper Jack. It's Godoka in his more usual position out on that left touchline. Looking for Lato. McFarlane was highest. Bell rolling it up for Peters. And again the roar comes up. Peters slowed it down a bit. Shannon, Peters again. Clark. Madeley's offering him support. Clark. Peters brings it down. Chivers couldn't get a shot in. Hughes. And again the Poles pack back into their penalty area. Hughes checks out of that one well. Has he done too much? Curry! It's 
just not coming off for England tonight, for Tony Curry in particular, but everything is flying for this goalkeeper, Tomaszewski. Hunter. Bell. Curry. Maidley. The long high one. Peters across. Bell won it back well. Now Hughes. Hunter. Hunter, the right foot. Szymanowski got it out. Poland constantly pinned back deep. Curry. Hunter. Hughes. Hunter still going. Peters. Not long enough. Wozanski gets it out. Domaski. McFarlane gets him. Well, there had been a flag already for the foul. doing a touch of the old soldiers Dana now looking for Godot a little more than 10 minutes to go as this most vital World Cup time continues to pulse and thrill with life here at Wembley Tony Curry Peters, Hughes has gone on running to find ball for him. Far post. Has he? Well, he's given the corner eventually. Bell went flying in the box, looking very solidly as though he got a push in the back. But perhaps referee Loro figures one corner, one penalty is enough. Corner ball. Hunter making it his, but uh, some pushing meant that even if the ball had gone in the net, Norman Hunter would not have scored his third ever international goal. Time is on Poland's side at the moment. Ten minutes to go. Emin Hughes. Oh, that's a bad ball. A gift to Godoka. Godoka trying to get on a shooting angle, I think. Decides to give it to Dramaski. Poland playing it back again. Made a mistake, and Bell punishes them. He's in quickly. And Musal sends him flying. And does referee Lara reach for his book? I don't think he does. Musal. did his job he stopped that attack breaking the man Colin Bell who had gone in so fast to break up the poles threat Domaski down for Lato and if he gets a break on McFarlane there could be trouble here that is a positive booking Roy McFarlane gets the yellow card. Roy McFarlane gets the yellow card. But there was an, a, a case in point. That's about the third time in the game that Lato has been stopped by that unpleasant little phrase, the professional foul, purely and simply because England defenders knew he had the legs of them, knew he was going to break past them. Now an anxious wall as Dania, who can quite easily clip one in from this range. Capable of bending a ball a considerable distance. It's Dania. Trying to get it through the wall. Couldn't. Hunter comes out. Bell. Play on, says the referee. The advantage is to England. Maidley. Bell. 
Curry. The tension affecting the Poles now. They're so near. Shannon. Surely. Vasilikiewicz was the man who got it away. Lato on for Godoka. And Lato goes again. And he's got the speed. Damaski is supporting him in the middle. Godoka. The ball, not a good one for him. So England are released again. Colin Bell. Hughes. Bell. Can't possibly get through. Far too many Polish bodies then. On the far touchline, Harold Shepherdson is kneeling there. Lato's all right! Why did Hunter stop? Hunter's back on the line now. Uh, Peter's back on the line. Lato! If they get one now, it's curtains. There goes Kasperjak. Kasper Jack, the chance then to have put this game, I believe, beyond England's reach. Six, seven minutes to go. Cannot. There's Lato now. Screwing this ball back. But the attack comes to nothing. And Kasper Jack hits it wide. But back live, England are building and constructing another attack. Shannon. Bell. Now Hughes. Bell again. Tries the shot, too ambitious. Poland have got six minutes on my watch to live. To live, to gain a, a prize of a trip to Germany for the World Cup Finals at England. Two points dropped in Poland. One point dropped here against Wales. Are now struggling to find that elusive match-winning goal they've had so much of the game but it's 1-1 Godoka Mushal Godoka way back for Gorgon Godoka again Bell Deliberate foul again by Musha. The free kick given, but nothing more. Curry. Peters. And Gorgon away. As far as Hunter. Trying to get it onto his left foot for the shot on goal. But again, Domaski breaks out. Lato leading the dummy run for Bidoka. Madeley forward. We begin to wonder now whether England, in fact, have got enough stamina left to put a penetrative attack on. And here's Dana. Dana against Madeley. Dana! Might have done better if he'd knocked it across to Lato then. But that would have been curtains. These England players must have run further tonight than any three league games they've played in the last month. They've never stopped running. Lato. Dana. And England are stretched to the limit now. Time ticking away from them. Dana. Goodocker couldn't get in on the shot. Colin Bell. Has he got the legs to start anything going again? Curry. Bell. Hughes in hard. Shannon must come over here for Clark. Shimanovsky facing him. Evelyn Hughes. Clark. It's so packed inside that box. Where's the gap? Curry. Couldn't find it. Look at the tiredness etched in the drawn face of Tony Curry there, reflected in every other white-shirted England player around there. And these poles are pretty groggy too. 
Look at that. England won, Poland won. Two or three minutes left to play. As Lato breaks again and the tired legs of the England defenders come back to try and square up to him. Corner ball. Poland's second corner in the game. The tension. Utterly tremendous here and still this England crowd willing their side to get a goal. At the moment, the pressure's on them. Godoka to take the corner kick. Poles have five men in the box. McFarland away, but not far enough. Casper Jack has it. Taking on Curry. A chance for Damaski to set some pressure on England again. Casper Jack. He's offside. Shannon, Curry, Peters, is this the moment, Bell, no goal kick and the substitution is going to be made, a dramatic gamble by Sir Alf Ramsey, Kevin Hector is to be waved on, this prolific goal scorer for Bradford Park Avenue and then Derby County over 200 league goals coming on for his first taste of international football who are they calling off Kevin Hector for Martin Chivers but has he been given enough time to do anything about a minute and a half on my watch as Martin Chivers is pulled away is a minute and a half enough Sir Alf Ramsey giving Martin Chivers a pat on the back and Lato streaking forward against Madeley. Madeley keeping everything under control. The free kick was given for offside anyway. Hunter. Now, Emlyn Hughes for England. Good ball on for Kevin Hector. Vemikiewicz gets it away. The pressure again. McFarlane, Hector, on for Hughes, and just a corner, that's all, we're down on no watch to seconds, seconds only. Tony Curry. Kevin Hector I think I'm sure it was Hector we can see it again in the instant replay and off the line at the very last second and the Poles have lived dangerously but they're still living referee Loro looks at his watch we're in injury time now we are in injury time and England are drawing the game, but they're losing their chance of going to Germany. Hughes, tremendous tackle by Chemikiewicz. Watch Peters. Gorgon got in the way. Bell. And it cannons away. Saki kicks it off the line. The ball had beaten Tomaszewski. He was still off his line from Bell's shot. And both Zaki was the man. Wolzatsky who knocked it out. A foul throw given. Which will suit this Polish side. This red-blooded Polish side. Who have really done a turn up for the books here at Wembley tonight. Norman Hunter have England got time now no they have not it's over it's all over and for England one of the blackest days they've ever had Sir Alf Ramsey must be a very disheartened man 
but he still has a handshake for Polish officials. Polish players, photographers, Polish uh, supporters out on the field, and that man, Tomaszewski, probably one of the happiest footballers this stadium has ever seen.